Thousands of Venezuelans have moved to South Florida, fleeing an oppressive government and a failing economy. Most of those Venezuelans are here on visas that will one day expire, exposing them to possible deportation. But now some South Florida congressmen are trying to protect them under TPS, Temporary Protected Status. Our senior political reporter, Michael Putney, has the story from the video port. Michael. Nicole, this is a rare bipartisan effort. Republicans, Democrats trying to protect these Venezuelan exiles from being deported back to a socialist country that's falling apart. The legitimate leaders of Venezuela are in the assembly. In Doral today, Democrat Donna Shalala stood side by side with the Republican Mario diaz Balart and an array of Venezuelan exile leaders. If there's ever been a case that, that merits TPS. And this administration has recognized the situation of Venezuela. If there's ever been a case, this is it. Venezuela is in crisis going downhill. Food and medicine are in short supply. Inflation is rampant. Politics are unsettled. And Nicolas Maduro has just begun a new six-year term as president. But the Trump administration has hinted it may throw its support to opposition leader Juan Guaido, president of the National Assembly. We support the assembly. We think that Maduro is illegitimate and a snake. In an interview that aired last night on Univision, Maduro was conciliatory, asking for a face-to-face -face meeting with President Trump to make peace. diaz Ballard says that will never happen. I think the only negotiation that should be had with the thug is a negotiation as to how and when to either get him out of the country or to send him to prison. President Trump has spoken out strongly against Maduro and his government, even hinted at armed conflict. But Trump generally opposes TPS for Haitians and others fleeing natural or man-made disasters. diaz Balart is cautiously optimistic about Venezuela. President Trump, of course, has said on many occasions he opposes the Maduro regime. He supports Venezuelan exiles. If he means it, then he may sign the bill to give them TPS. In the video, Port Michael Putney, Local 10 News.